What is up guys, Shaunas is here and this time we're going to talk about episode 65 of season 4 from My Hero Academia and the episode um, was called Overhaul and I'm happy about this because if you guys didn't see my previous My Hero video I was wondering, the guy with the beak, I was like, who is this guy? Like, who is he? So we got finally got to learn a little more about him today and I always thought he was strong because you can't put a beak on someone's face and have him have that sort of swag for him to be weak like I always know he had some sort of fresh sort of quirk so him and his group him and his crew met with the um League of Villains and we learned that Overhaul is actually a Yakuza and those are sacred criminals that used to thrive before All Might and the Heroes took over so we learned a little bit about his background and that he's trying, he wants the League of Villains to work under him because he's thinking Shigaraki, who is, I believe is the um, the son of the seventh user of One For All. So he wants the League of Villains to work under him. And Shigaraki's like, I'm not having this. So they had a little altercation, but one thing about Overhaul is he has some sort of quirk. I was like, if he touches you, do you like blow up or something? Like, I didn't know what he did, like actually, but it, it looked it looked fresh though. Like he just touched someone and their body just exploded. And then there was another moment where someone threw a projectile dart at someone and they couldn't use their quirk anymore. So they they got some some stuff I'm curious about. Um like I said, I'm not gonna call him beat guy anymore. I'm I'm gonna call him overhaul. So um I know you manga readers probably already know what's going on with this, but I'm an anime guy, so I'm really excited about what the League of Villains are going to do with the, um, the Yakuza guys. So I'm really curious about that. And then we go off to the heroes. Deku wants to do work studies with All Might's assistant, I believe, or his, his, his sidekick. His name was Sir Night Eye. So, and we learned that my guy Togata... You guys know how I felt about him from my previous video. And Togata, he reminds me of Obito because they both have the phasing ability. Togata works alongside of um, Night Eye for work studies. So, so Togata was the main one to determine if Deku was ready to work alongside of Night Eyes. So we got some good conversations with Togata, One For All, and Deku. And... One for all, for some reason, doesn't want to talk with um, Sir Night Eye. I'm, I'm not sure why. They, they might have some sort of history together, but the confrontation that um, Deku had with Night Eye was hilarious. So, Night Eye is someone that you pretty much you gotta make him laugh. So, if you don't make him laugh, I guess he's not gonna like you or something. But the, the face that Deku made to Night Eye, him trying to replicate um, All Might, I was like, wow, like. I don't think Night Eye didn't really respond to that, but if it was me, I, I would have laughed for you, Deku. I, I thought that was funny. Like, you tried hard. So, that's where the episode ends off. So, I'm not sure um, how Sir Night Eye and Deku are going to get along for the next episode, but that was just my quick little analysis of um, episode 65 of season 4 from My Hero Academia. Alright, guys. Peace.